Yes, so what's going on, everybody? It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. Check it out, man. This is my uh, the guy that I made yesterday, man. I thought that he was 6'4, but he's 6'3, so he's a 6'3. Uh, two-way playmaker. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, man. I have been impressed with this guy so far. They let me shoot threes with him. They let me hit mid ranges. Um, my mid range, my mid range is only a six. Day. You see that cast? Look at it, green in threes. Mid ranges, I I can't. It's it's rough. It's rough right now. I can't really hit them, especially in the park. But uh, threes, threes are pretty much a breeze. And the reason that threes are breeze, um, I'm gonna show you in a second why my why the, why the three ball is a breeze. Uh, I'm not working on the bads right now. Let's go to the nav. Let's just go straight to here, man. Um, standing layup and uh, driving layup, uh, 77. That'll go up to like 80. Uh, 45, uh, 45 standing dunk, but I got a 61 driving dunk. That's all I need right there, man. I'm not missing much. Um, if I get that maxed out, I think that maxes out to like 65, maybe 70 or something like that. But, I mean, that's that's more than enough. It's more than what my, uh, it's more than what my two-way... A sharpshooter has, so I'm good with that. My my contested shot mid. I, I made him with max arm length, so I'm gonna have to go up. I'm gonna have to work my way up to the uh, contested shot mid being 60, uh, 68. I mean, uh, over 70. So hopefully they'll give me some points on that soon. My my open shot three is 70. I can hit that pretty well. I'm hitting that at like over 50 percent. Um, so. I don't understand why people can't really shoot in this game, man. I can hit this at over 50% with this guy, especially with the Duckworth shot, so it's good. Ball control, I started out with uh, 88 speed with ball, 80, um, 86. Passing vision, 86. 86 uh, post offense is irrelevant. Uh, rebounding, look at that, man. It's rebounding for a guard. Look, I'm, I'm getting high 60s. I think that goes up to almost 70 or right at 70. Steals at 77, that'll go up to like 80 if I'm not mistaken. Blocks are maxed out. Somebody asked me how I always max that out uh, first because I play defense, man. I play good defense. Uh, vertical 78, lateral quickness, uh, that should go up to around about 80, uh, 77 for right now. Speed 95, acceleration, instant acceleration. These go up to almost, uh, these should get up to like 99. Uh, strength, 69. He said, he said 69. And then uh, stamina is uh, 60, I mean, uh, 97. So I found out today that you definitely, if you got a guard, you you really need those two bars, man. Because without those, without those two great, without the two bars, you it, it's 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 insanely difficult to uh green. It's insanely difficult to hit shots and go to the rim and stuff like that. And I'm gonna show you um my signature styles, my 2K lab stuff right here, man. This is these are it's not only the best jump shot. In the game for right now, I'm, I'm tweaking. I'm working. I'm working on another jump shot. So don't quote me on that because I am working on another jump shot, and hopefully it's going to be even better than this one. But it's going to be hard to beat the Duckworth man. So uh, we're just going to go through everything, man. Check it out, jump shot creator. Uh, you know, this is it right here. Uh, Duckworth. I'm doing Duckworth. I think I told y'all to do it at um. I think I made a mistake when I made it. I'm doing duck worth at 30%. You can do it 30 or or 20%. It really doesn't matter. Uh, it's about the same thing. Darren William base. And then um release five. And you see the split right there. So you got that. That's what you got for right there. Um my animations that I have, because like I said, man, I'm I'm I've I've got a whole bunch of stuff that I got going with this guy. So uh obviously my shot is that shot. We got that. Y'all don't care about free throws and stuff like that. Dribble moves, signature styles. Crossover, Pro 6. Um, moving behind the back. I'm using Pro 1. Uh, let me see. Move and spin. We're using Pro 8. Let me see. Is this one here? Yeah, I did that because it's so. Um, moving hesitation. We're using uh, Pro 7. Uh, rhythm dribble. I just like AI, man. Y'all know I'm an AI head, man. So, you know, I'm, I'm using that on Iverson. Uh, the size up, come on, man. Y'all know I use normal three. Uh, no, this is normal one uh, for my hesitation combo. Uh, crossover combo, still using normal one. Everything else, I think I'm still using normal one between the legs and all that. Um, I think I'm going to change my between the leg to uh, curry or whatever, though, because that's just what I normally go with. Um, I'm just pretty much using what I used last year. Honestly, 
you don't need no dribble moves on this game. Like, you would think that you don't need a lot of dribble moves on this game. You don't need one dribble move on this game, really. Um, you can use them, but I just find it a lot easier hit somebody with a size up and cross over. I just do like I do in real life. I instead, I don't, nobody spam dribble moves in real life, right? You, I hit them with, I walk up, I might hit them with a walking size up and see what they're gonna do. Once I see them commit to one way, pew, I'm going the other way. Dude is so fast, and I'll show y'all that in a second. He is so fast, that is crazy. Um, layup package, y'all know I got crafty. Uh, dunk package, under rim pulls. Side clutches off one. Obviously, you gotta have that. This dunk is the most OP dunk in the game, and now that I can get it, I mean, if I, if I can get my two-way uh, sharpshooter to have this dunk, it's gonna be trouble, man. But this dunk is the most OP dunk in the game. Baseline reverse off one. This is the only character that I can get it with so far, and I love it. And um, front windmills. I like the front windmills, just, just when I'm in transition, when I take off. And, uh, you know, all these unblockable. And then uh, the straight arm tomahawks. Even though he don't really want to do the straight arm tomahawks or whatever, man. I don't know why, but he don't really do the straight arm tomahawks. But those are the signature styles and stuff like that. Like, this is for the simple heads like me. I, I mean, simple guys, simple head, whatever. You know, I ain't putting on no celebration. Y'all, have y'all noticed that, that you see more people stone facing and standing still than any other 2K because nobody's gonna buy these animations because nobody wants to spend the VC on it. So you know it is what it is. But um, that's about it, man. I mean, with, with this guy, man, I, I got him to be extremely simple. All I wanted to do was D up guards, make guards miss, and, um, and clamp down guards, get steals and stuff like that, and hit wide open shots and feed the offense. Badges that he gets, um, these are the badges that he gets. Diamond, Lob City Passer, Ankle Breaker, uh, Pick and Roll, Maestro. I really don't have no bad dog. I've been playing raw. Uh, I get Acrobat. This is not maxed out, so that's good. Tyler Scorer, um, Posterizer. Is this maxed out? That might be maxed out. Uh, no, it's not maxed out. Difficult Shots, Break Starter, Chase Down Artist, Pick Pocket, Pick Dodger, uh, Charge Card, Defensive Stopper. Uh, bruiser, one man fast break, free throw ace, uh, glue hands, and uh, quick reflexes. Now, y'all saw, if you go back and watch the video, the five hour video of me playing with this dude, you guys saw how I was playing today. I have not played one my career game with this guy. I haven't done anything with him. We haven't played one my career game. I got no hot spots, nothing. I have not taken a shot with him in my career. He's supposed to be 6'4", 215, and made him be 6'3". It sucks, uh, but it is what it is. I wanted him to be 6'4", but I, I guess I made a mistake. But like I said, I just been playing. I went straight to the park. I have not played uh, um, one my career game with him. I haven't played any, any, uh, anything else. But like I said, man, the only thing I do is with him. Most of the time, dude, this is all. This is it. I, I hit him with a size up. You know, I come in, come in, hit him with one of these right here. Go that way. Hit him with a step back. Hit him this way. Hit him with that. Ah, uh, ah, uh, little moment. Like, it doesn't really matter because most people in this game, when you start the little size up like this, and then you momentum dribble the other way, or you just, or you, or you do, do what Swante said. You hit him with a momentum dribble and then a behind the back. Most people are dead in this game because they can't play defense. So, I haven't really had to do anything, and anything else, his speed more than comp his speed more than compensates for it. So, I feel like I feel like he's a good player. Um, I can hit jump shots, like I said. Uh, somebody was asking that, so yeah, he can hit jump shots. If you just look at look at the video that I put up today, you know, of our stream, you see I can hit plenty of jump shots, um, even clutch shots and everything like that. The only thing is, why won't he do the the straight arm tomahawks? Like, I haven't been able to trigger those dunks. I don't know if those dunks are broken or wet, but he just wants to do windmills. He won't do the straight arm tomahawks. But it is what it is, man. But I haven't had any real issues with him. I think we won, like, uh, we had, look, I was the primary shooter a couple of games today, and we and we only lost, like, I think we went, like, 30 and 10 today, something like that. So we won a lot of games. We didn't, we only lost a few. And, um, you know, when we had, when we went and got a stretch big, uh, we played with us, uh, what was his name, Smash DC. He was a stretch big. I think we only lost one game when we played with him, and we shouldn't have lost that one. That was some craziness. But um, 
other than that, we lost a few games today, but it was to be, be expected. When I'm the primary shooter, and then you got Brutus Sam, he can't really go to the rim because we're playing with Fuzzy Bad Feet. He and Fuzzy were slashers. So the fact that we won as many games as we won, and we were just joking around, playing around, and Fuzzy was a 77 overall, and all we doing is out there having fun. The fact that we won as many games as we won, it, it, it tells me that this, it's something to this guy, and I, I feel like I could really get busy with him. But um, my other two players, I will get them to 90 tomorrow. Once I get them to 90, um, it'll probably be done for them. The other thing about this guy is you got to be careful. If you're badge dependent, dog, you get no shooting badges. You don't get catch and shoot. You don't get corner specialists. You get no badges for shooting with him. So I'm just letting you know you don't get shooting badges. This is what you get. You get ankle breaker, uh, flashy passer, dimer. I think those just go up to go. Live City Pass and Pick and Roll Maestro. So I guess Pick and Roll Maestro is sort of a shooting badge, but um, you know, you're not really gonna, you don't have anything to help you shoot the ball like that really. But I guess Pick and Roll Maestro is all I really need. I wish I could get corner specialists to catch and shoot. It would help tremendously. But the fact that I was shooting in the park today at over 50% from three, that tells me everything I need to know, man. Like I said, man, if you're thinking about making one of these guys that's super fun, that's super fast. He's he gonna be the fastest guy on the court. Nobody gonna be able to stay in front of him. And uh, you can get to the rim at will. The thing is, you have to know, you just gotta reel yourself in and say, hey, I know I can get to the rim anytime I want to, but I do need to find my find my guys and get them open. And then just this just this is regular point guard stuff, knowing when to pass and knowing when not to pass. That's all you need to really be worried about. But if you're a point guard and you getting tired of people just splashing on you, I would say, um, I would say try him out. Let's see what badges he gets real quick. And then um, and then we'll we're gonna let y'all get up out of here, man. 2K Labs. NBA 2K Labs. Let's go to 2K Labs page. I'm not sponsored by them. I would like to be sponsored by 2K Labs. So uh, you know, if if y'all wanna sponsor your boy, you know, come on through and uh sponsor your boy, man. You know, I like to promote the site. But anyway, the right way. But anyway, um, where we at? Right here? Nope. Nope. Uh, let me see right here. Hold on one second. I got to get the monitor cap up right quick, guys. Uh, is it this one? This one. Okay. Well, I can't get the light. I can't get it up. Pause. I can't get the, um, I think it's not seeing my monitor cap right now. So I'm not about to, I'm not about to, uh, to do it, but I'll tell y'all what, what you get. With a playmaking lockdown, I get gold dimer, gold ankle breaker, uh, let me see. Can I do display capture? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so what I get is display capture. Let's move it over. Uh, let's get the mask off and then I'll show y'all filters, no filter. Uh, all right, can y'all see that? Let's get that and make it bigger. Let's make it big. Pause. All right, so this is what I get right here, man. I get. I'm able to get uh I get gold dimer, gold ankle breaker, gold pick and roll maestro, gold live city passer, gold flashy passer, and gold break start. I really don't care about any of that. I get one man fast break on silver. I think that's pretty good. Cause when you get in the open floor, you're not gonna catch him. You get acrobat on silver, uh, which I think that's really good. You get Tyler score on silver, defensive stopper silver, that's really good. Uh charge card silver, nobody cares, and picking picking pickpocket. Pick Silver, so that's really good. Pick dodge, you get uh, bronze. I feel like guards should get pick pick dodge at the highest ability, but whatever. Bruise on bronze, uh, difficult shots on bronze, chase down artists on bronze, posterizer on bronze, which I don't even know why I'm getting posterizer, but I'll take it. Uh, glue hands. Okay, so I get gold glue hands, gold free throw ace, and gold quick reflexes, but everybody get that. So like I said, man, I really feel like for me, it's a good build. This is the way I like to play. Y'all gotta realize, I like to build my characters the way that I like to play, and I feel like everybody should do that. I like playing hard-nosed defense, and then I like doing everything else. Just, like, this is like my real-life player. I play hard-nosed, end-to-end defense, and then, um, y'all think I should make, I'm gonna put this shirt in the game. Y'all think I should make this shirt in the game? Hey, let me know if I should put this shirt in the game, this Deadpool shirt in the game, just like this. Cause I like I like this shirt. I just thought about that with this. Matter of fact, I'm gonna go over to the kiosk and we're gonna try to put it in the game right now. But y'all let me know. Would y'all vote for it? 
I don't know. If y'all would, let me know in the chat. I will put I'll put this shirt in the game right now because I love this shirt. But anyway, um, I'm about to do that right now too. So y'all y'all look for it and vote for it because I'm about I'm about to put it up on the on the block in a minute. But uh, really, like I said, man, I like I like this bill. I think he's a good player. I mean, that's just for me. But you know, it is what it is, man. I, I feel like uh, he's a good player. I like him. I think that a lot of people worry about what other people are making a little too much. And um in in a in a in a way it just sucks because people instead of being creative and being, you know, what they should be, they want to be what everybody what they think everybody else should be or they want to be whatever the easiest thing is. So what's the easiest thing um you know what I'm saying? What's the, what's the easiest thing to be? You know, so I, I feel like a lot of people don't even like slashers and they pick slashers, not slashers. I, th I feel like a lot of people don't even really like the, um, I don't even know what color gray really is. Is, is it in the middle because it's everything mixed together? I think it is. Um, I think a lot of people don't even really like um, pure sharps, but they just pick them because they feel like it's easy points and they feel like, uh, they feel like it's easy points, and they feel like, yo, if I get if I can get easy points, then uh, people will think I'm good. I really believe that. I don't think people really like pure sharp shooters. I don't think people really want to be pure sharp shooters. There are some exceptions. There's an exception to every rule. But, hey, I'm just trying to show you guys something different than what everybody else is doing or whatever like that, man. So, it is what it is, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if y'all want this Deadpool shirt in the game, I'm about to, I'm about to make it right now. Let me know if y'all like it, and then uh, once I get finished with it, I'll, I'll let y'all vote for it, and we'll go from there. But um, other than that, I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! 360 out this mug. Man, it's supposed to be an attribute video, and I'm, I'm out here. I, I end up making a t-shirt off sleep. I'm going, man. Peace.